Hey, hello everyone, and welcome to this new video. Today, we will be talking about API mocking using Microx. So let's go to uh, the Microx workpage at microx.io. Here you can see some information on this uh, new platform that is Kubernetes native. So if you're doing your APIs on Kubernetes, this will be very useful for you for mocking and testing. And the latest version also includes uh, Apache Kafka mocking. So it's pretty interesting. So you can uh, get all the benefits of deploying on, on Kubernetes. So let's get started. Uh, as you can see, the uh, recommended uh, quick start includes just a couple of um, instructions, actually three, for uh, running on Docker Compose. This is the easiest way to get started with mocking. Um, so the first one is to clone the GitHub repo. So let's go to the terminal and then just um, clone the repo and then uh, change the folder to the uh, Docker Compose installation. And then we can um, execute just Docker Compose up so we can start using the um, Docker file that they created for us. It will start um, the different containers. And if you want to see what is the status of each one of those containers, you can just um, execute Docker PS so you can see uh, how many containers were created and are running. Currently, there's also only four containers, the application, um, the uh, single sign-on, as well as the database. So um, let's uh, take a look at the um, logs of each one of those um, uh, containers so we can see that they're running. So let's start with the Microx container. And as you can see, that's a Java application that is running on the Spring, and it has already started. So let's do the exact same thing with the Microx single sign-on that is based on Keycloak. And we can see again that the uh, container is up and running. Let's get back to our browser and then navigate to localhost 8080. This is the port where the application is running and it will automatically direct us for the uh, single sign on where we can use the user admin and the password 123 and um, access the, um, the main dashboard. So the dashboard is where you can see uh, how many uh, APIs and, and what is the execution of, of your um, ecosystem. And you can see the API catalog where you can upload your applications user the importer and you can do some admin uh, capability. So if we see here, I already have an API with three operations. And the interesting thing here is that uh, Microx automatically creates uh, mocks based on the uh, uh, specification. So as you can see here, when I update, upload uh, an example, and specification with an example, it's automatically a mock endpoint where I will be able to retrieve that example. So we can copy this um, URL created by Microx. And if we go to the browser or any um, uh, HTTP client, we can just query that uh, API and see that the uh, return, it's, uh, it's that API example. This is uh, pretty interesting and uh, it's very straightforward to get us started. So, if you just want to do a cleanup on your resources, just uh, run Docker Compose down. I hope you like this video and let's see next time.